Howdy folks, it's Harrison with Mainly Acres Farms. Thank you for tuning in with us today. Uh, let's see what we have going on the craft table this afternoon. Alrighty, here's a couple other projects that I've uh, been working on here recently. And what these are, are these are some grain bags that we get when we get our chicken grain. And I've just taken them and converted them into um, little totes that you can take with you to the grocery store. So that way you can cut down on the waste in the landfills of plastic bags. And I thought this was a really cool idea. I learned from a few other uh, YouTubers on how to make these custom grain bags. And we have a couple different varieties here, but I've been cranking those out here recently since I've had the sewing machines up and going. So I'm going to be, I have uh, two more of these that I need to put together and then we'll be all done. But they're real simple. I've seen a lot of tutorials on how to make these. They're usually quite long winded, but the short nit and gr nitty gritty is, is on your grain bags on the end of it where it has that strip that attaches the bottom you just cut that strip off measure three inches from the bottom after you've cut that strip off uh, mark three inches up cut a straight line across the bottom and then um, with that little material that you cut off from the bottom you'll use that to make these little handles as you guys can see they're just folded over and then you take your sewing machine and run a stitch along and it completes your handles and then on the bags, you just simply, on the bottom side of the bag, you guys really can't tell, but take my word, this is the bottom of the bag after the three inches have been cut off. And you just simply uh, sew a seam across the bottom here with it laid out flat. And then you kind of fluff it out and you will notice that you have seams here that were already put on there from the manufacturer. So after you sew that seam, you kind of fluff it out and then you sew across the seam and make like a little triangle point and that makes little gussets for you on the inside, which will allow your bags to sit flat as you guys can see there. And then maybe inside of the bag, you can see these little corners. I don't know if that's picking up. Hopefully you guys can see the little corners in there. And then you just simply uh, sew on your handles. On the inside after you've done a little hem across and that's it it's real simple they're real easy to do um, like I said this is one that's already been cut and it's ready for the seam to be sewn across and then the gusset corners sewn in so it'll have a flat bottom and then you just roll these over make a little hem sew around there put the handles on and you're good to go so hopefully that has given you guys some ideas they're really easy to make but what you were going to want to do is get you know probably five to six grain bags and then cut them all up the way they need to be and then fold them and then that way you can do all your sewing in one day it makes these go by a lot faster and I was able to um, make a complete bag after it's been cut and everything it only took me a half hour per each bag so they're real fast to get going once you already had them cut out and ready to go so that's just something we've been doing on the homestead. So I figured that's another project to show you guys. Alrighty, hopefully you guys got some new tips and crafting ideas. As always, like, subscribe, and if you thought this video was helpful, please share it across your social media. Take care and spend time with that family.